Mighty Poseidon, Lord of the Black Sea Depths, swirling dark and deep, whose will shapes the currents of faith. Save thy servant, break upon the earth, and sweet waters spring forth. Pull me with tide and grant me safe harbor to the vow. Mighty Poseidon, Lord of the Black Sea Depths, swirling dark and deep, whose will shapes the currents of faith. Save thy servant, break open the earth, and that sweet waters spring forth. Pull me with tide, grant safe harbor that that. Mighty Poseidon, Lord of the Black Sea Depths, swirling dark and deep, whose will shapes the currents of faith. Save thy servant, break open the earth and let sweet waters spring forth. Pull me with tide, grant me safe harbor at last, and shield me from something, something. <laughs> I couldn't read that last part. Let's try again. Mighty Poseidon, Lord of the Black Sea Depths, swirling dark and deep, whose will shapes the currents of faith. Save thy servant, break open the earth and let sweet... Mighty Poseidon, Lord of the Black Sea Depths, swirling dark and deep, whose will sh Mighty Poseidon, Lord of the Black Sea Depths, swirling dark and deep, whose will shapes the currents of faith. Save thy servant, break open the earth and let sweet water spring forth. Pull me with the tide, grant me save our at last, and shield me from the storm that approaches. <clears throat> Anyways, so... Uh... That took a while to do the intro, because the intro was really, really short, so I just, I just wanted to keep reading it, you know? You can interact with highlighted objects by hovering over them and pressing left mouse button. Aliana, part 1 over 8. Father told me he had great news today, but he did not sound pleased. He said that I had been chosen, that I was to serve in the temple as an oracle. I have always felt like I did not belong in the kitchens, but mother never let me see anything else. Dirty pans and pots all day. I prayed to him, and now my God has answered. Why can't father be happy for me? Oh, wrong key, resume. I don't know girl, why can't be father be happy for you? Okay... Moving up... Ooh, what's this? Is this a stick? Can I grab it? Uh... Let me check this one. What's this? Just bricks, huh? Ooh, note! Ooh, what? What was that? Heard something over there. I can see you. That note can wait. Let's look over here. I'm very curious. Oh, it's a well. Nothing inside the well. Oliana, part 2 over 8. Today is the day they take me to the temple. Father said I could not call him father anymore. And that no one at the temple can know about him and mother. I have a bruise on my shoulder where his fingers dug in when he grabbed me. The acolyte should come by at some sunset, he said, and that I should not worry, but I do worry. I have never seen that look in his eye before. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Bell. Rope? No? Okay. Arcus, part 2 over 6. She is to become his, body and soul, chosen by fate, they told me. An oracle to see the future and grant blessings according to Poseidon's will. I won't let him take my beautiful daughter. I have seen what the Hierophant and his followers do to those poor girls at the sanctuary. Chosen, but for whom? Whose will is she to please? Very interesting story going on right now. Uh, I I admit I'm a bit confused, but I'm guessing uh, something's up. Okay. The Lord of the Deaths hides many a secret. What secrets does this place hold? Oh, there we go. I'm 
such a genius. Aliona part 308. I am not going to be an oracle after all. Father came with some men and killed the priests. One of his friends got stabbed and I screamed. Father slapped me until I fell silent. He never hurt me before. Then they dragged me away somewhere within the temple. They locked me in here with a wounded man. I can hear his rag breathing. There is a bubbling sound when he exhales. They got blood all over my blue dress, too. The one mother gave me on Solstice Day the last summer. I wonder if it will last. <laughs> I made my own script. Alright, let's go down. Left, right, just being cautious. Something like can't even pass through this. It's very dark over there. Uh, let me just keep crawling towards that stairs over there, I think. <coughs> Hold control the crouch. Of course, I already knew that. Needs to be a note here. Uh, let's check again if something's over here. Nope, nothing. Checking again. Just to be safe. Right. Due to the illness spreading among the servants, the Eastern Catacombs has been locked down and is under quarantine. The bridge leading to this area may not be lowered at any times by anyone unless explicit orders has been given by the High Hierophant. I'm gonna slowly move away from my microphone to be honest. Uh, I don't really want to be jumped scared at all. To judge it by that. Uh, I don't think I can move here though. So let's go back to where we came from. Uh, I'm guessing he told me to sprint. Alright, moving away from the microphone again, just saying. If in any case I do scream. Uh, please pardon me. So I'm just gonna keep sprinting. Ooh, something's here. What's this? A sword? Oh, a torch. Oh, God. What is that very loud sound? Like something's walking. Seriously, man. Oh, okay. Hold and light the torch. Gotcha. Oh, that is very freaky. I feel like something's watching me right now. I'm guessing this is a new place though. Aliana part 4 over 8. I'm in haze. It is dark here. I have not seen the light of the sun in days. The slave's father sent to guard me to let their eyes linger longer than they should. It makes my skin crawl. Their master comes by now and then to leave supplies but never stays long. They haven't acted upon the things I see in their minds. But I can't sleep with them so close. I wish father was here. The whitewashed bones that fill these tunnels whisper to me. Call for me to join them. I might take them up on their offer. Just look in there. Oh god. I'm out of torch light. What is that? No idea. But I'm not looking yet. I'm going left. Whoops. Dead end. Is anything following me? Nope. Arcus, part 4 over 6. I have found a way to hide her from all of them. Morals and gods alike. Kiraculous until his slaves will watch over her down there. No one will ever look for the living amongst the dead. I just hope she will understand that I do this to protect her. Ever since Tema has died, she has refused to talk to me. I 
probably should not have slapped her like that. But her scream could have ruined everything. Tamias' death was a hard blow for all of us. A slap is nothing in comparison, yet I wish it wasn't done. I long to hear her sweet laugh again. Someday, soon, when they've stopped looking, I will make her smile like she used to. Ooh, bow and arrow. Awesome. I guess we get to fight stuff now? Oh, three arrows. Okay. I wonder if I get to shoot something. I wonder if I shoot that thing. And I just wasted one arrow. I don't know if I'm gonna shoot it. I just waste another one. Thank you. It's always the last arrow. I think I'm gonna rush this. Keep going. Oh god, it's dark and dark. And oh fuck! What was that? What the hell? Oh my god, what is that? Is that a minotaur? gonna rush this. Hope he doesn't see me. Woo. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Eliana part 5 over 8. Last night they came in when I was sleeping. I was so certain I had barred the door, but I must have forgotten. Such a small mistake. When father comes he will have them killed. I told them so, and they laughed. Why would they laugh? It hurt more than the rest. The bones sing to me now, a wordless hymn. It's helped me after they left. I just lay there and listened to it for hours. Let's get fire. And let's move on. Okay, moving right. be something over here. Oh, there is. Aliana, part six over eight. The bone song is within me now, and they can sense it. The melody vibrates just below my skin, and those monsters no longer dare meet my gaze. Last time they came for me, I gouged one of their eyes out with my thumb. Now they keep the doors locked and stay away. Father has left me. He buried me with the other corpses. I hate him. I hate them all. I feel like something's gonna happen here, right? Eh? I'm just gonna keep moving forward, you know? Like, woohoo, nothing's happening. Yep, that was a dead end. Okay, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, yep, okay. Marcus, part 5 over 6. I buried Tamias today. It had to be done in secret, but he deserved a place of honor for his sacrifice. I washed his bones myself and sent them down with the acolytes to be buried in the tombs under a false name. I cannot risk going down for a visit, but I miss her more than anything. The Hierophant suspects that someone amongst the lower priests have stolen her away, but so far his search has yielded no results. I have. Uh, Alright, okay. Be the way. I say, songs 
Not the way! <gasps> oh my god, what the fuck is that? <gasps> it's back! Oh shit! <gasps> oh. Holy shit! Oh. What the hell are you? Oh my god! <sighs> oh shit! I don't even know where he is though. Why did you drop that? Okay, he's lost interest. Run for it. Go through here. Oh God. Oh shit. What the hell? Am I back here? I think so. I don't believe I've been here before. I hear footsteps again. So there's probably another one of them here. Just choosing random paths to go. I don't even know where I'm going. Oh god. Come on, make it. Make it. Oh. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Fuck. I almost made it though, but was that, was that it? <laughs> <laughs>